Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today is a good day, uh, the end of the, the day. Just want to jump in and uh, talk a little bit about TMJ and uh, how you look at the jaw and you can tell whether the patient chew one side or another. If they chew more on one side, what happened to the other side? Here's all he got. Mm, he wanted to do braces. And um, I took a panel and just want to see uh, the wisdom tube. And it turned out that um, uh, it's exactly what, what I predict. I look at the x-ray, I see that the left condyle have very small, um, smaller size compared to the right condyle. I'll show you, I'll zoom in again so you can see. So as you can see, the, the left condyle, very narrow condyle compared to the right side, very rounded condyle. This indicated that this condyle is being very active with chewing and that's why the um, stimulation of the bone grow and not diminish from not not growing naturally and on the left side. So I asked him the question, hey, do you, um, you probably chew the, more on the right side than the left side? And it's true that he said, yeah, he doesn't like to chew on the left. He likes to chew more on the right side. So this, this is the reason why the left side very narrow uh, a condyle compared to a very nice routed right side condyle. So uh, that is something uh, interesting. And um, when I look at the inside his mouth, the other thing I noted, the reason why he seemed to be chew <clears throat> enjoying chew chewing more on the right side than the left side is because inside his mouth, I don't see um, number uh, 32 uh, coming in. It's still under the, 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 the gum. So when he chew, he doesn't have so much of the trauma from chewing uh, on the upper and lower art come together. So it, do, it doesn't hit uh, together with the soft tissue and it doesn't hurt him. That's why he can comfortable chew on the right side. But if you look at the left side, um, on inside his mouth, this thing is actually, uh, the buccal cuss here is actually sticking out on the gum and it leaves the, uh, 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 the behind that uh, buccal cuss is the gum tissue. So as he chew on, uh, number 16 is resting on the uh, gum side, the uh, rectal molar part, and it's actually giving him pain. And um, he does have class two occlusion, so mostly everything chewing is related to uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, the whatever contact uh, up here, but little contact down here, but because of, there is space uh, available here, so when he closed down, it hit the gum. That's why he doesn't like chewing on the right side. So once again, uh, just quick, uh, quick uh, discussion about TMJ uh, joint related and um, condyle and how the size of the condyle you can pre uh, look like and how you predict where, how the uh, patient chew. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye bye.